Rampage versus Matita, Saturday, November 20th. Check your local listings. For the first time in UFC history, four former champions will enter the octagon on the same night. Rampage not afraid to exchange with anyone. This is where he's the best. DJ is so solid and technical, one of the best in the world. UFC light heavyweight champion Rampage Jackson squares off with fellow former champ Lyoto Machida. Hall of Famer Matt Hughes completes his trilogy with two-time former world champ BJ Penn. And George Sotoropoulos puts his unbeaten UFC record on the line against relentless submission specialist Joe Lozon. The countdown to UFC 123 starts now. November 20th, UFC back to Detroit. Lyoto Machida, former UFC light heavyweight champion. is taking on another former UFC light heavyweight champion in Quinton Rampage Jackson. Matching belts may be all the two former champs have in common. Machida is cerebral, utilizing traditional martial arts to subdue his opponents. He has this Shotokan karate style. He keeps his stance different than everyone else. He stays further back than everyone else. And it's hard to deal with. I've been fighting for a long time now. I got 38 fights, man. You know what I'm saying? It's not going to be a whole lot that surprised me. It's karate. Karate, we found out, sucked years ago. So I think everybody got mesmerized with this movement. Nobody cuts him off. Nobody tries to cut him off. The key to this fight is Rampage being able to come out, use all his weapons, engage, and just destroy Leona Machida. Rampage is pure power, using brute strength to smash and slam his opponents into submission. Rampage has the unique ability to put any human being to sleep with one shot. Whether it's Vanderlei Silva. Chuck Liddell. Anybody he connects with is in deep, deep, deep trouble. Rampage's biggest threat is his body. He's a very strong guy. He got very heavy hands. I'm going to complicate his game plan by moving around, and I don't think he's going to be able to find me. He's not the fastest Liotto. The speed is going to be the main thing for Liotto to win that fight. I'm going to fight my fight. I'm not fighting his fight at all, fight my fight. Whatever Machida wants to do, we got, we got something for it. He's highly, highly motivated to put on a good showing to get himself back into the top five of the division. Oh, 
He knows that he needs to win over Lyoto Machida and he needs to win big. This fight is going to be interesting because we are two former champions. Lyoto Machida! It's not just anyone who becomes a champion. The key will be seeing who can better impose their game plan. I don't see the fight going very long. Quinton lands once, and Lyoto will not be able to recover from him. Quinton's going to knock him out. He's one of the very strongest guys at 205. If Rampage gets a hold of you and slams you on your ass, he's going to knock you unconscious from a slam. I always do what I do. I haven't done nothing different yet. I think he probably needs to avoid even getting in the cage with me. That's probably what he needs to avoid. Coming up. Leota Machida is a mystery to a lot of people. A very difficult puzzle to figure out. He is very elusive. It's ultimate fighting championships. Here comes the red. I was an elusive guy. <laughs> Normally, Lyoto Machida and Rampage Jackson train on opposite sides of the globe. Machida at his father's dojo in his native Belém, situated in northern Brazil near the mouth of the Amazon River. Rampage. 4,600 miles away at the Wolf Slayer Gym in Widnes, England. But for this fight, Rampage is training in a rented warehouse near his home in Rancho Santa Margarita, California. The only reason why I decided to have my camp in Orange County is where I live, because if you guys think about it, you know, saying I have kids that I haven't seen. The guy just hasn't seen his kids, he hasn't drove his cars, he hasn't slept in his bed. It's time that he spent some time with his family. My kids ask me in Japanese, are you my daddy? <laughs> that's, an, that's, an, that's embarrassing, man. One guy asked my, asked my son, <laughs> is that your daddy? He went, I don't know. <laughs> Machida, meanwhile, is just 66 miles down the road in San Diego at the gym of his Black House teammate, Minotauro Nogueira. We have a hard time finding a little level heavier weight sparring partners for Lyoto in Belém. In San Diego, he can train with the Nogueira brothers and Junior dos Santos. It's given him a real confidence boost. If Rampage wants to see Machida, he should drive an hour south. Because once the fight starts, the man they call the Dragon can be difficult to locate. Lyoto Machida is a mystery to a lot of people, a very difficult puzzle to figure out. He's got this ability to leap forward and attack and then leap out of range. Tito says, let's go, let's go. And Machida does. Lyoto's whole game is to be elusive. Um, and I fully expect that to happen in this fight. Such an unusual style that Lyoto presents. He will attack, so you can you always have to keep your guard up. You always have to be ready. Oh, oh that's that's a huge that's body shot. Oh, big left oh, to Machida. The guy's going to try to frustrate you, and he's going to try to beat you into fighting his fight. Me, I'm just going to do my thing. Here comes the rampage. Oh, 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 he got oh, 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 When somebody paid me to fight, I come to fight. I want to come and fight. I don't, I don't think people pay me to, to be elusive. It's the ultimate fighting championship. It's not ultimate elusive guy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What's going to be critical for Rampage is that he connects with Lyoto and he connects hard. doesn't want to get it by Quinton. Unfortunately, at some point, like in the Rashad fight, Quinton's going to come close. And I would say Rashad has got a much tougher chin than Lyle, so, so it's going to be interesting. Despite Rampage's wrestling background, 
Machida's camp insists that their fighter is superior on the ground. Liot is very good black belt jiu-jitsu. I think on the ground he can take care of Hampage. There is an old samurai saying, if you pay too much attention to the leaf, you miss the tree. If you pay too much attention to the tree, you miss the forest. So I really can't just focus on one thing. There's nothing Leota Machida does that Rampage Jackson is concerned about. And Rampage is going to walk right through Leota Machida, put his fist right on his chin, and Leota Machida is going to sleep. This is truly my return. A victory over Rampage puts me back on track for a title shot. Oh, another another shot, shot to big trouble. Oh, another shot. He's getting teed up on. He found it. He found it. It is all over. He can say whatever you want to say. I'm going to do my talking in the cage. Rampage versus Machida, Saturday, November 20th. Check your local listings.